not trying to dodge a question, is I expect that by the end of this decade, and possibly somewhat sooner than that, we will have quite capable systems that we look at and say, wow, that's really remarkable. Are we just scratching the surface of AI with ChatGPT? What's the hype around AGI? When exactly is this likely to happen? What happens when AI surpasses human-level intelligence? I know you have all these questions. Now, stay with me, we'll delve into this hype and reality. Since its public release in November 2022, OpenAI's ChatGPT has generated a buzz unlike any other language model. Amassing over 1 million users in a mere 5 days, it has sparked discussions about its potential to disrupt entire industry and automate certain jobs. The rapidity of its rise even evokes comparisons to landmark tech launches like, yep, you guessed it right, the iPhone, with some experts dubbing it an iPhone moment for AI. But before we get swept away by the hype, let's pause and consider the perspective of ChatGPT's OpenAI is phenomenal. ChatGPT is phenomenal. Um, everything else, all the other models are phenomenal. Well, first of all, that's nice of you to say, but ChatGPT is not phenomenal. Like ChatGPT is like mildly embarrassing at best. Um, GPT-4 is the dumbest model any of you will ever, ever have to use again by a lot. Um, yes, you heard it right. Sam Altman said that GPT-4 was OpenAI's dumbest model that anyone would use again. This means that although GPT-4 was a major advancement at the time, he views it as relatively unsophisticated compared to AI models that will subsequently come. Altman reportedly implies that GPT-4 will soon be obsolete and much more capable AI systems will replace it by much more meaning. It's the type of AI that mimics human intelligence, with the ability to learn, reason, solve problems, and adapt to new situations, all without being explicitly programmed for each task. Let's hear what Sam Altman's definition is. How do, how do you think, you know, how would you define AGI, and how do you think you'll know uh, yeah, when I we should have defined that earlier. It's, it's a great point. I think there's like a lot of valid definitions to this, but uh, for me, um, AGI is basically the equivalent of a median human that you could like, you know, hire as a coworker. Um, so and then they, they could like say, do anything that you'd be happy with a remote coworker doing, like just behind a computer, um, which includes like, you know, learning how to go be a doctor, learning how to go be a very competent coder. Like there's a lot of stuff that a median human is capable of getting good at. And I think one of the skills of an AGI is not any particular milestone, but the, the meta skill of learning to figure things out and that it can go decide to get good at whatever you need. Um, so for me, like that's, that's kind of like AGI. Uh, Let's see what AGI might look like through some characteristics. General intelligence. Unlike current AI used for creating social media content, AGI wouldn't be limited. It could tackle new challenges, like writing a scientific paper. Machine learning. AGI wouldn't need constant hand-holding. It could gather information on its own, analyze it like a chess game. Current AI excels, but can it strategize based on a new game and even learn new skills without specific instructions? Adaptable to change. The world is constantly evolving. AGI could adapt its strategies based on real-time information. It might even predict unforeseen circumstances, like a weather forecast predicting a storm before the first raindrop falls. While achieving human-level intelligence remains a hurdle, the characteristics we just explored paint a picture of AGI's immense potential. These very futures distinguish AGI from current AI which excels at specific tasks, but lacks the general intelligence and adaptability of a truly human-like mind. When will this happen? This discussion on AGI brings to mind the bold prediction made by futurist Ray Kurzweil, who believes artificial intelligence will reach human-level intelligence by 2029. He recently reaffirmed this claim at the Abundance Summit AMA. Tech entrepreneur Elon Musk also waded into the debate, suggesting human-level AI is just five or six years away. Musk defines digital superintelligence as surpassing human capabilities in any domain. Interestingly, his timeline for AGI aligns closely with Kurzweil's 2029 prediction. The burning question, when will artificial intelligence, general intelligence, become a reality? Experts are divided, creating a fascinating mix of hope and uncertainty. Optimists point to the exceptional growth of machine learning and processing power suggesting AGI could arrive within a few decades. Realists acknowledge the progress but highlight significant hurdles. True human level intelligence, they argue, might take centuries to achieve. Skeptics throw a wrench in the works altogether. They believe the human mind's complicity may be beyond the reach of machines, casting doubt on AGI's very possibility. Now, 
let's turn our attention to Sam Altman's perspective on AGI's arrival. I, I, I obviously have so many naive conceptions when you start any company, uh, and, and particularly in a field that's like moving around as much as this one is. But my naive conception when we started is that we would like get to a moment where we didn't have AGI and then we did. And it would be a, a real discontinuity. And I still think there's some chance of a real discontinuity. But on the whole, I think it's going to look much more like a continuous exponential curve where what matters is the pace of progress year over year over year. And you and I will probably not agree on the month or even the year that we're like, okay, now that's AGI. We can come up with other tests that we will agree with, but even that is harder than it sounds. And, you know, GPT-4 is definitely not over a threshold that I think almost anyone would call an AGI. I don't expect our next big model to be either, but I can imagine that we're like only maybe one or two or some small number of ideas away and a little bit more scale from something we're like, mm. It sounds to me like the technology roadmap is pretty clear with no major known showstopper to get to AGI. The cutting edge of their research must be at least six months to a year ahead of what the public has seen. So if they are just extrapolating another three or five years from that, this would already be late stage AGI development. Either way, it seems that AGI is pretty much the expected outcome. The race for AGI is well underway with the potential to revolutionize countless aspects of our lives. However, significant challenges remain both technical and ethical. Continued research, international collaboration and open discussions are crucial to ensure AGI is developed safely and ethically benefiting all of humanity. What do you think about AGI? Put it in the comment box and thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel.